the false of all of English class, so I'm going to introduce you about cluster bombs. On February 28, 2022, well, Russia attacked Kharkiv and so many people died and were injured. And so right now, Russia has invaded Ukraine, and so, well, many people will take photos and videos of Ukraine, and I'll send them on to SNS, well, Instagram, or Facebook, or many more. Okay, so, like that. These are coming into our world. And so, while during all of those photos, there was one photo of a cluster bomb. Well then, what is a cluster bomb? Well, a cluster bomb is first a rocket. So this rocket is launched from a well a truck or something, and so it launches. And inside this thing, there are many, many little and lots of bombs. So this rocket then well opens, and then the bombs comes out, and then explosions happen, and then that rocket also gives some well damage with all of those rockets too, well all of those bombs. But however, thirty percent doesn't explode and lives as a threat, and even in March of two thousand twenty-two, a man died from a remnant of. A cluster bomb. Also, cluster bombs are bright, like yellow or something. So children are attracted to them, and so many were hurt by explosions of cluster bombs that hadn't exploded during it was used. So in 1977, well, the treaty said that war should not target citizens, but well, that is happening, and plus. Plus, it should only attack military bases, but they don't. And also, there can't be indiscriminate attacks, which is cluster bombs. And there was also a cluster bomb treaty in two thousand eight, but U.S. and Russia and China didn't sign. And plus, in two thousand nine, U.S. used it, and in two thousand twenty two, Russia used it. Uh, well, cluster bombs really is a problem, and so we really need to get cluster bombs out of our world. Okay, today I introduced you about cluster bombs, and next time I'll come with a different topic. Bye bye, and see you next time.